Hello everyone and welcome to episode 34 of Lord of the Rings The Battle for Middle-earth Good Campaign Millionly. Today we are going to take the forces of Rohan and we are going to attack the Druadan Forest to liberate it. Yeah, yeah, Gandalf, we hear you think that already a thousand times. This old wood lies at the foot of one of Gondor's beaconed hills. So the enemy has a main encampment that it's a bit tougher to break uh, because it has a bit of trolls uh, guarding it. But other than that, it's it's okay. He's going to give experience there, uh, he's going to get out of his uh, horses and uh, we have all the guys, put them on wall and yeah, ready their swords and now we are going to go down here. There are some um, trolls down here but we don't care about them and just for a safety precaution I'm going to close the gates and uh, yeah, we are going to go straight for their camp in order to take it. We are not going to waste our time with those outposts um, and our resources trying to take them. Um, we are just going to rush their main camp and then the second camp and then after we did rush successfully those two two things then we we can deal with those outposts uh, also and yeah here is another camp we don't have the resources to take it uh, and I'm not going to leave a guard to guard it I prefer in the first part of the mission to just grab a uh, all my army because they will try to attack me and uh, I don't enjoy getting attacked and here there is one outpost that I'm going to just um, to just go past it I don't care about it it's I uh, I don't think they they are going to actually build anything there so yeah Oh no, they just destroy it because they... Man. Well, you cannot have nice things as evil and expect that the forces of good will not ruin your day, I guess. And yeah, let's not forget that here there are some trolls that uh, more than re they are more than ready to show you who's, their, who's your boss. Oh, there are four of them actually. And uh, we we are going to yeah uh, she's going to uh, attack one of those okay and the rest of the elves are going to deal with this one um, the the nice things they are running to try to get to certain troops and because of that. Uh, yeah, you go and attack this one. The the nice thing is that they are um okay, you, you Oh man, they they are so idiotic some troops. Uh, okay, I need to start healing them because otherwise they will just die. Oh man. The the idiot Yeah, the fact if they flay their ar arms around or not, it's completely random, basically. It's, yeah, actually completely random. And here we, we start having a problem with my troops. And I'm going to retreat them because, look, here comes the fire archers ready to make my life uh, hell. So these guys that are a bit uh, hurt, I'm going to move them back. And I'm going to actually start putting my heroes forward um, and yeah strike them down yeah and now it's time to take the, their camp and this is one of their two camps that they have 
Um, that's nice. This is the most well defended because of those trolls. And and uh, and now I'm going to go for the other one. And uh, yeah, hopefully by the time I'm getting to the other one, my guys will be rank ten. Uh, just give them some experience. Yeah, uh, he grants you their favor, but uh, where is? Yeah, they are not quite ready to level up. So here again, some economy, nothing too much. And that's basically their hardest uh, map, uh, hardest camp to break because of those trolls. That, yeah, they can really ruin your day. And you don't really have a lot of overpowered he heroes like you have with Gondor that can just make a laughing stock of, out of those... Uh, uh, those trolls but yeah the gates should hold and yeah anyway since probably um, I will have to wait till I manage to oh yeah they are stupid they oh wait they anger the troll and now they are paying the price there are a lot of neutral trolls here so Oh, oh, wait, 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 wait. Um, yeah, uh, deal with them. I don't want any surprises. Uh, so, yeah. He's going to be very mad. Wait. Okay. My cell phone decided that it wants to have some uh, problems. Okay, I will have to deal with him later. I'm just going to restart it. And yeah, we, we are going to take over, not really, and uh, deal with these guys and uh, yeah, move forward with our lives. And um, I was thinking uh, the these days a bit uh, regarding uh, the new new year and uh, yeah the fact that yeah uh, every every year is this like uh, so to sp oh man they they build defenses here that's not good. I, I'm going to actually deal with it, but first I want to just uh, heal my guys and then I'm going to attack and first I'm going to save also. Um, basically, I am I was thinking about these New Year's resolutions that it's so also popular to make them and um, it's also very popular to don't uh, keep them. <laughs> just make them and not keep them and i was thinking that the reason why this happens is mainly because uh people are making these resolutions these new year resolutions but those resolutions are not becoming their priorities because if one thing is your priority you will uh you will do everything um, to to make sure that that things takes place if yeah sports are your priority then you are going to make sure to to practice lots of sports because that's your priority but if one thing is not your priority then yeah these these kind of things they they are not going to to happen uh, because yeah they they are simply not your priorities basically and I was thinking that yeah this is why so many people are failing their uh, resolutions because yeah they they are not their priorities the resolutions are not their priorities and if if you don't make your 
priorities out of your resolutions, then yeah, you are not going to magically transform yourself uh, through the night and be like the best you that ever existed. So yeah, th this is not going to, to happen. You, you need to actually make sure that yeah, the resolutions are your priorities and they they should run because uh, otherwise they they are going to get murder uh, and yeah we don't want that and you guys come and attack because they are starting to send some really nasty troops to me and i don't enjoy that and uh king sh the king should be with them uh yeah uh Please just destroy it before they manage to do more good than Okay, uh yeah, you, you go and destroy it and then you, you just run away. So yeah Too too many people are just uh saying they are more like wish list. Oh I wish I, I, I wish that things would be like that, uh, but yeah, just wishing is not enough, basically. Just just wishing for something to be true, it's not enough. Um, so yeah, just having a kind of a wish list. Oh, I, I, I wish that uh, that would happen or that would happen or this and that and things like that. Uh, yeah, in order to succeed at your New Year's resolution, you must do more than just treat them like a bit of a wish list. Oh, it's something that I wish. I wish that I would do more sport or things like that. No, you you needed to treat it like a priority. Well, uh, I said that, yeah, my New Year resolution is... Uh, being a, a sportive guy then i'm going to work for it uh did i lost the squad uh no i didn't so i i'm, I'm going to work for that uh and uh yeah i will make it a priority and for priorities you always make time uh if if you you if you have a thing as a priority the the truth is you will always make time for it but if one thing is not your priority then you will never make time for it uh, and unfortunately that's the sad reality of of the things oh wow um you kind of need to start coming here and uh, uh deal with it because uh, otherwise they i don't know from where they start appearing that and the king of rohan as king of rohan you should grant them their your favor and oh man, they still have a long way to go till they manage to level up so um actually i'm going to put some fountains here some healing fountains uh, and uh, yeah, I'm going to take my troops and start attacking. And I, I'm going to go for their outpost. I know that they have an outpost here and I'm going to go for it. Because um, it's just the outpost that it's <laughs> my neighborhood, in my neighborhood. Oh, and they they seem to really like their assault trolls to, to go and uh, attack and yeah... The yeah, enemy have settled here already and these these are not their run of the mill trolls. They are like they are from an outpost, I know that for certain. So yeah. Um But we know where their outposts uh, are, so I shouldn't have a problem with finding them. But just in case they are not from our outpost, I'm going to save. Um but I don't think that I'm attracting random uh, rolls from around the the map. But yeah, basically everything it's about 
yeah, your priorities. What is priority in your life? Because for what you consider a priority, you make time and you allocate resources to make it happen. If your priority is to buy a house, you will do everything to, to make that happen. You will work more, you will do more overtime, you will try to make maybe some side gigs uh, to of side hustle to, to make more money. You will look at what kind of loans you can take and things like that just to yeah just just to make it happen but if you're happy living in a rent rented place then yeah it will be like oh oh no oh, oh no it's the the same yeah i i know for certain that uh, he has uh there uh, they, they kind of took the outpost uh, and we are going to attack them because I'm starting to get tired of them and their shenanigans. So here I'm going to put some armories. Yeah, they... Wait, where, where do they came from? man yeah you guys should start uh, taking the trash out because they are starting to get annoying uh, and I'm going to make some towers some defense towers because I know for certain they come from here uh, they are attacking the encampment so yeah here is the trolls that they keep sending at me, so they, I'm 100% sure, yeah, they, they, they took their base here. This is a full assault base. Uh, I, I'm going to uh, just, and I, I will be careful uh, about certain things, because yeah. I, I let them roam the map and this is my reward. Basically they kind of uh, start attacking me out of the blue. And the, the problem is that they attack me s with some heavy stuff. Uh, like uh, with those trolls that can make my life enormous. Uh, very, very difficult. So yeah. And the King of Rohan should grant their honor to those guys. Perhaps they will get to rank 10. Yes, they did. And now, since I do have the money, I'm going to take those outposts. I will not let them untaken. Because, yeah, enemy do go for your outposts and they do try to get them. And I'm certain that... They took this camp there, and this is why they are coming with all this uh, trash. That's becoming more of an annoyance than anything else. Because, yeah, my leveling up is complete. Yeah. They settled here already. Uh, oh, yeah. Here is like a peaceful <laughs> troll that just decided to... Well... Let's attack there. And I'm going to take uh, this lady and I'm going to attack with him. And I'm also taking this one and I'm going to attack with him. And... Uh, yeah, I need to be careful, basically. Because, yeah, now now they start running through it. Um, well, you, you guys should uh, attack there. You should, guys should attack there. Uh, yeah, 84 and don't let them kill you. And yeah, I, I they, they still have some things. And you guys, why are you letting them do that? Come on. Uh, that's, that's really annoying. That's for certain. But my elves are doing very well, so... We are starting to go and perhaps this is their last uh, 
Yeah, the enemy is upon us, man. Reform the lives. Because we kind of need to. And we will have victory because we are going to destroy everyone of them. And the nice thing is that uh, except for summoning Barlock, the enemy doesn't have anything else going for them. But this should be their last one. Or perhaps... No, of course not. They took everything on this map because... The problem is the enemy doesn't have your money issues. Uh, with your guys, you you have money issues. The enemy does not. Because the enemy has unlimited resources. Because they are awesome and you are not. Well, not quite unlimited. You can actually make them run out of money and in the siege of um, um, Endoras, as you're playing with the evil, uh, you you can actually make them run out of money. Uh, and yeah, here here comes them. And actually I'm going to take some squads and I'm going to order them to take this down as fast as they can. Because the last thing I want is a troll running around in, in the middle of my, my, my troops. But yeah, th this troll will die. Oh, they actually make a drummer troll. That's interesting. But yeah, anyway. Mission 1 uh, without losing any squads. That's awesome, actually. And yeah. We are victorious. Yeah, we did our bonus objective. Two units gaining ranks. And we have total victory and yeah, everyone is ranked 10, yay! And yeah, Eomer is the best of the best. If we would have archers that he wouldn't be the, the best of the best. But anyway, that's it for today, I hope you enjoy it and see each other next time. Take care and bye bye!